WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently we have all the U.S. indices that we track trading to the downside. You get the Dow off 441 points, 1 and 3 tenths percent. S&P's off 64, 1 and a half percent, nearly 2 and a half percent for the NASDAQ 100, 1 and 7 tenths for the Russell. Semi's nearly 3 percent, 85 points to the downside. Trendy's off 262. You've got gold trading out of 1904. That's up eight bucks. Silver's trading out of 2358. That's nine cents to the downside. Lights recruit up three dollars and twenty five cents. One hundred one eighty is its print. Natural gas up twenty seven cents. Six ninety four there. And the thirty year treasury is up uh, nearly one point. Trading out at one forty two sixteen. If we take a look at our nine panel market update chart, we begin by taking a look at the ES mini. What do we know? Well, the first thing we know is that uh, so far prices held. Let me just expand this chart out, make it a little bit easier for everybody. So you can see a nice little rising trend line. Prices tested that both yesterday and today. It's traded down in towards the bottom of its weekly profile. That's at the 4189 level. You get below 4189, that's going to send a uh, signal that price is going to go test or should test the February 24th low. That low out there is 4092. You've got an A to B equals CD to the downside. No bullish reversal candle. So price should continue to head lower out there. Now, closing below 42.39 today, that's a TD9 count breakout level. If you close below that, that suggests lower price. But, of course, you've got that weekly bottom of its profile. Spot Politonic still above its 50-day exponential moving average. That says it's wind at the uh, right, right, staring at the wind for the S&P 500. Uh, if we take a look at the NQ, the NQ right now is wants to really go target. It's trading below the bottom of its bullish structured weekly profile. That level is 13.405. We're trading right now at 13.190. Price should go target test the 12,942 level. That's the bottom of its March 15th swing point. Take a look at the U.S. dollar index, strong leg bull. Uh, no topping pattern that I see in place out here today is bar number seven of a TD9 count. You could get a short-term topping signal between tomorrow and Friday. If you take a look at gold, gold has held its breakout level. That's a TD9 count breakout level, as has silver. Price just simply needs to continue to close above 1895.60. And in the case of silver, it's 2348. Light speed crude is trading above the top of its daily profile. That suggests a run for its descending trend line in the 105 area. Natural gas having a nice day, but just consolidating with inside its daily profile. Resistance there, $7.23. And the 30 year treasury, she wants to go target the 143.23 level. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zen Show. But if you're off to start your Tuesday, have a terrific one. We look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care.